Smoke filled skies across the valley and the smoke forecast something we're keeping a close eye on for you because uh, well another night with some of us seeing some beautiful sunsets with a big red sun once again, but some of us will get a break from the smoke and then I'm afraid things might even get worse for many of us. Here's the forecast for late tonight with the smoke in the blue here kind of shifting its way out of the Devil's Lake Basin, out of Jamestown. Here in the valley, we still have a chance at some smoke. So the sun setting in the west for our western counties may not have that same red hue, but if you're in Minnesota, there's a good chance of that. Now, the sunrise still looks smoky. We get a break from the heavy particulate matter over the top of us, but look what comes back. So we go through the day tomorrow, starts building into the northern parts of Minnesota for the afternoon and overnight. So bunch of today, uh, tomorrow rather, a little bit of a break with an increase in smoke density across the depth of our atmosphere as we go through the day and into Wednesday. It gets very bad in places like Crookston, Foston, Thief River Falls, Grand Forks, and northern Minnesota. So maybe even enough to smell it at the surface once again. Here's a look at current conditions out at the Dakota Magic Casino, and we can certainly see the the haze in the sky there. 84 degrees out of Hector and at Moorhead's Airport. We have a south wind at 15 miles per hour, but it's been gusty out there too over 30 miles per hour at times. We have mid 80s across the Southern Valley until you get into the James River Valley 89 there. It's 87 in Grand Forks and we do have some low to mid 80s across all of Western and Northwestern Minnesota. Couple of blips on the radar out there where the fires are taking place in Southern Canada. That's basically just east of Lake Winnipeg. For us, we're clear, we're quiet and hazy. Visible satellite showing this haze in the sky. You can see it here. Here's something sweeping through in that little change in the wind direction, sweeping that layer of smoke out of our North Dakota counties as we head into the afternoon and evening hours. Hour by hour forecast shows border showers, a possibility, particularly later tonight on or near Lake of the Woods, War Road, Bedette, the Rainy River. As we go through the overnight hours, that activity ceases and we'll have temperatures near 60 to 65 to start our Tuesday. The heat returns by midday. We'll see the wind, though. It will be out of the north. North winds going to usher in that smoke, so that's going to start changing things up in our northern counties by late in the day. The heat builds once again, similar to today's temperatures across the board, but a break from the smoke until late from the north. It will start building in. Now, as we go through the late night hours, there will be some storms developing out in the western part of South Dakota. Those could be in store for some areas in our southern counties on Wednesday. By the time that weather wiggle works its way into our region, 65 to start your day tomorrow. Expect temperatures to rise pretty quickly. We spend many hours from noon on well in the 80s and that lasts beyond dinner. After sunset, we cool off a bit. Mostly sunny skies, a north wind. We won't have much of the haze or the smoke to deal with in Fargo and western counties up in northern Minnesota. It'll begin returning in the afternoon hours and maybe even thick enough to where it might even uh, be something you, you can taste. So if you have a respiratory illness, a heart condition, you may want to take it easy with going outside. We're filling the atmosphere with smoke, more red sunsets in the forecast for tonight and again on Thursday. Smoky weather returns on Wednesday. We cool off with that system working its way through. Mike, it looks like a chance for some thunderstorms, mainly in our southern counties, and then it looks hot for the weekend ahead. Once again, Mike, the 90s are set to return to us here in the valley. It's the summertime. We got to accept it. We can do it. All right. Wildfires are burning.